Oh my god. I think I want to cry. Is that the end of the game? What is going on, everybody? I am Brandon, aka The Frustrated Gamer, and welcome to Marie's Room. So this is a game that has been taking Steam by storm right now. It's, it's like I said, it's on Steam, and it's an absolutely free game. And I think it came out, if I'm not mistaken, it came out this weekend, two or three days ago, and has already gotten over 700 reviews. All of them are overwhelmingly positive. So I know I'm a little late to the party, but I figured, you know what, I am going to give this game a shot. And, and we're going to jump right into it. So I know, just a little premise, I know you're... Marie, you're in Marie's room, and Marie was one of your friends growing up, and something tragic happened. I know it's an emotional roller coaster, so I'm gonna learn along with you guys. I know it's narrated by the woman that's exploring. I didn't want to come back. Why would I, after all that's happened, even in here? So, where is the journal? Okay. Alright, so when she's narrating, the uh, the screen kind of gets smaller, it looks like. And now I'm in full control. Alright, so I'm moving around with uh, W, A, S, and D. So she said, where is the journal? This looks like it could be the journal. Oh no, wine California, guide. California, crisp white wines. Mm. I'll need a crate of those when I get out of here. <laughs> okay. Alright, so... Ooh, can I select it? I know you just have to hold and drag. Oh. Alright, so that's just changed the picture, but nothing happened. Where's the oh, weather forecast? Is that... What, more than a hundred again today? Glad I don't have to deal with that anymore. Wow, okay. So maybe she's in Arizona, Texas, I don't know. But clearly she's in a warm spot. Door, can I go in here? No, that's her parents' room. Okay, alright, she yelled at me there. Oh. What was that creak? Alright, I don't think this is a horror game, but uh, I'm scared. Don't need to go in there. Oh my That's god. the bathroom. Okay, so I guess it's this door. Alright, so we're one for three. So I guess this is Marie's room, which is the name of the game. So I assume most of our time is going to be in this room. Ooh, I got an achievement. Uh, welcome back, Kelsey. Does it say Kelsey? Okay, so I guess my name's Kelsey. Ooh, is this the journal? Marie's journal! Okay. Hi, Let's... Kelsey. Oh. Yes, I'm talking to you. I know you've been reading my journal. Can I ever forgive you for what you did? Honestly, I don't know. Wow. I'm trying really hard, but I don't know how. Because I don't understand any of it. You are my friend. And I loved you unconditionally. I did what I did because of you. And I stood up to him because of you. But you... I don't know. Right now, I can't be near you. So I don't want you to come find me. I promise I'll be all right. Marie. Except she wouldn't be. She would not be all right. I wonder what happened. So I guess that was Marie that wrote in her journal knowing that Kelsey would come to her room and um, snoop around a little bit. I don't know. So clearly this Kelsey girl, the one that I'm controlling, clearly she did something serious to Marie. And I don't know if Marie is dead. I don't I don't know, but we gotta search around a little bit here. Let's see. Ooh. Mr. Torres and Marie were robbed in their own house. Not long after we met at Food Rescue. Wow. He was stabbed. Almost died. Oh my god. She was knocked out with a baseball bat. She was in the hospital for a while. Stitches, concussion. She still had headaches, she said. Wow, okay, so that is... Clearly this Marie went through a lot growing up. Okay, I'm just trying to select Marie everything. Marie insisted on saving these. She was going to make a new world with them. Whatever that was supposed to be. I've never actually seen her build anything. Okay, so make a whole new world with pizza boxes? Okay. She asked me why I was so angry all the time. And I told her because... It's a dirty deal. It's Russian roulette and utterly unfair. The cards I'd been dealt. Any player would have passed. I chose to be angry instead. It's kind of fun. But Marie, <laughs> my friend Marie, she got me a new deck and suggested I deal again. Okay, so I don't know what a lot of this means. A lot of this is... Oh, what was that? Journal updated. Oh, okay, so I guess she's updating the journal as we're going along. 
Ooh, takeout menu. Every Tuesday, the food trucks would roll in. Me and Marie never missed Jorge's tamales. When I was a kid, Jorge would put some aside, just in case my mom was too drunk to feed me again. Oh, okay. Wow, okay, so we got some, uh, two people that went through a lot, it sounds like. Case? Okay, oh, what's this? Ooh, we found a case. I want to open that. I need to find oh. the key. Damn it. A five-figure number. All right, so I guess that's going to be something that we're striving for. We're going to be looking for a five-figure number. I have a dream that one day I will select this pillow. Me, don't you ever dream, Kelsey? And I said, I don't. I don't dream. Okay. I plan. What I didn't tell her was that I wouldn't allow anyone to mess with those plans. Wow. Okay. So we got an intent. Kelsey is an intense girl. Orange peels. So I thought this Marie is dead. Maybe Marie's not dead. I'm confused. Or Marie's in hiding. Either way, why are there fresh orange peels on her bed? Well, maybe they're Have not fresh. I peeled an orange so juicy, the drops erupted from underneath its skin like fireworks in the setting sun. The trees in Mr. Jones's garden had them. I used to live off his garden vegetables and fruit. Before I met Trevor. Oh, Trevor. Okay, I have a feeling we're gonna learn more about more about this Trevor. So the orange peels. I'm assuming maybe they're from Florida now. So I was saying Texas or Arizona. I'm thinking Florida. Ooh, let's search Kelsey's backpack. Wait, aren't I Kelsey? Let's look at my own backpack. Disgusting, but cheap. I got used to them after I didn't want to go to the food kitchen anymore. Oh. The vicious taste of these meatballs still beat the humiliation of being served by Marie. Oh. Wow, so Marie fed Kelsey at a food bank. Wow, okay, so we got, um, we have an intense story here. Can I select, ooh, can I select the computer? Ooh, laptop, nice! Password, oh, damn it. Oh, I don't know the password. All right, I guess I have to find the password. Ripped shirt. When I ripped... My pants. Trevor. What an asshole. Oh, Trevor. More about After Trevor. After we broke up, he got violent sometimes. One day, he dragged me through the school hall by my shirt until one of Marie's geek friends stopped him. Ben, I think it was. He got a lot of shit for it later. Wow. Why? I feel like he was a hero. Why would he get a lot of shit for that? Okay. All right. Well, I'm still looking for some clues here. I'm still looking for some clues. What can I select? Oh, I, I don't like the creaking there. Ooh, mixed tape? Check doormat. I'm not a shadow person. Yeah, it took me all I had to convince her she wasn't. What the hell does that mean? I am not a shadow person? Ooh, could that maybe be... Nah, this is a long shot. Ooh, is there another computer? Turn on TV. Ooh, that's exciting. I can't read it. What does it say? Uh, I guess I'm not Have supposed to read it. Have you seen this man? <laughs> yeah. I've seen him. I bet it's Trevor. I bet it's Trevor. Oh, it went off by itself. That was creepy. I kind of feel like Marie's room is haunted. Maybe it's Marie's ghost. Maybe the, uh, what was it? I am not a shadow person. Damn, what's the password again? I'm not, oh, yes, yes. Ooh, did you see that hint right there? I'm going to select it again. It said, I'm not A, so it's got to be. Here somewhere. Shadow person? Come on, come on. Yeah, all right. So I broke into Marie's laptop. All right, kitty gif. All right. Okay, I unlocked the cuteness overload award in Steam. Okay, so I guess that's kind of useless. There's got to be something in this laptop. Maybe that, that five-digit passcode. One day, I just had to know. What's up with all the cats? She said she admired them, that they were who they were without any pretense, that they had no fear of confrontation. She wanted to be more like them. Okay, so she wanted to be a cat. When Bumblebee went missing, Aww, Bumblebee. Marie cried for days. She thought I couldn't hear her at night. I could never prove it, but I'm sure it was Trevor. 
Oh my god, this Trevor guy is a just a menace. What a terrible person. Oh. What were you thinking? You know that's illegal. Oh my god. Okay, so something serious is going on with this whole situation. I don't know exactly what happened, what Kelsey did to Marie, but uh, things are looking a little bit not good. Why does someone not good. need to get hurt before we step up and uh -oh. act, for Christ's sake? If they had, none of this shit would have happened, and no one would have died. Wow, okay, so we have a harassment email Harassment by fellow students from Mr. Phelps. Hi, Marie. Oh, so this is from Mr. Phelps, I guess. Oh, it's the principal, if you look at the bottom. Oh, I'm spitting everywhere. Hi, Marie. It grieves me to hear that this is how you feel, but I'm afraid there's not much I can do at this stage. I understand you are alarmed and feel unsafe, but Trevor, it's this Trevor guy, has not broken any school laws, nor has he hurt anyone. Well, it sounded like he hurt Kelsey. He dragged her through the hallways. Whatever. I would like to invite you and Trevor in my office to see if I can start up a conversation between the two of you. Let me know when you are ready to talk. You know where to find me. Kind regards, Principal Phillips that doesn't do anything. Wow. Okay, so this Principal Phillips just completely, um, just completely ignored Marie. Clearly that this Trevor kid was doing something to her. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Why didn't you tell me, Marie? Oh. No wonder you were so frightened. We never should have gone to the Orange Grove. Oh, that's creepy. So this is an email from Trevor saying, I see you, and I'm assuming that's a picture of Marie. Okay, that is creepy as hell. All right, so this Trevor guy was messed up. Maybe Marie doesn't like Kelsey because Kelsey's the one that brought Trevor into the mix. I don't know. It kind of looks like that's everything from the computer. Ooh, what was up here? July 7th, 2018. So we're in the future right now, ladies and gentlemen. We are in the future. All right, that's kind of cool. All right. Uh, all right, that's all I really found in the desktop, or in the laptop, I guess it was. What else is there? I already searched that. Oh, I hate the creaking the creaking floor. I feel like I... Ch didn't I check her journal already? Oh, maybe not. I don't think I've been here before. Next. Okay, I'm not fearless. I'm just looking for numbers, basically. I love cats because they're not afraid to be difficult. Okay. Nothing. I have a dream. Hey, it was Martin Luther King. That's kind of cool. I, I, I didn't think it was actually going to be a Martin Luther King thing. She called me her friend today. I am not a shadow person anymore. She's my friend. Oh, okay. So this is a journal about her life and her friendship, I guess. Ooh, ooh, five, five. All right, I gotta, I don't know if I should write these down. It's only a five digit code. Is there gonna be more? All right, Kelsey took, okay. So it's just more stories. Hopefully there's another number on the next page. Damn it. Okay, so she's really into these guns. I can't sit and watch. I'll have to be fearless. So she's going through a lot here. Five. Damn it. So where's the rest of the numbers? Okay. Okay. So the reason why some of the pages of this journal are empty, like this one, is I guess I haven't searched the room yet for them. All right. So let's start searching around the room a little bit more. Let's, let's learn more about the story. I like this game. This is cool. I couldn't afford a car, and Marie didn't want one. So we rode our bikes everywhere. I thought I looked silly. And with those damn sparkly shoes, I probably did. Yeah, I was losing my glamour status at school right there. Okay, so they're making us go around the room and learn the full story. That's pretty cool. So you can't just rush through the she game. She loved being a birthday girl. Mr. Torres would take her shopping every year. Okay, I found something here, so I'm just trying to find everything. I loved skinny dipping, but Marie insisted on wearing this thing. Really, I mean, it was Mr. Jones's pool after dark. No one would ever come close to the freak. And he wasn't there, just to be clear. But someone else was. Who's this? Who's someone else? Is it Trevor? All right, so it sounds like Kelsey was a bit of a wild child growing up. Keys. Ooh, keys. Mr. Torres gave me my own set of keys, so I'd feel at home. I loved him for it. But every time I used those keys, I felt a pang of guilt. Why? He gave you the keys. Okay. 
So I'm trying to select everything. A stone. I didn't like that she kept the stone. Journal updated. Why did she have to be reminded? I told her I was sorry, but she said it was for me to remind me. Okay, so I got a uh, journal update that time, which is good. Definitely good. Hmm. What else is there? Ooh, open drawer. I haven't gotten in here yet. Lorraine, Marie's mom, died when she was five. My mother, she might as well have been dead. She looked more dead than alive, anyhow. Passed out on the couch, empty bottles of gin on the floor. Ugh. She sounded a little bitter there. All right, another journal. Uh, another, uh, ooh, record player. Another journal entry updated. World map. Marie always dreamed about going to Europe. I don't think she ever went. Okay, that was a quick one. Fan? Sometimes it got so hot, this thing wasn't doing it anymore. Then we'd take off to Mr. Jones' swimming pool. That night, I guess he must have seen us. Okay, so we're starting to get a little bit more of the story. Notebook. La La Ooh, a four! A four! That movie was a shit piece of crap. Glad Trevor snuck us in. I don't think I could have handled wasting 20 bucks on that. Never thought I'd see Marie there. Okay, and again, time she out. always was a dreamer. I bet she loved it. She so, never realized oh, I didn't want to be her friend in public. All right, are you done talking? Thank you, Kelsey. So, time out. So, I thought this was a story way back in the past, but La La Land came out this winter. So, I guess this is pretty recent. Whatever happened is fresh. And I think we also just unlocked a new number, which is very good. I like the sound of that. She was my friend, and I had to tell her. So, I came back here, throwing stones at the window. But she didn't react, so I threw a bigger stone, <laughs> and it shattered the glass. She kept the stone as a souvenir to remind her not to trust me ever again. Oh, so that's what the stone's for. So I guess I kind of uncovered that part a little ahead of time. Ring binder. Ah, uh, yes. The science project. Of all people, they chose to pair me with the girl from Food Rescue. Outrageous. But I got over it. So that's how they to met. my ass off. I had to if I wanted to get that scholarship. So I guess that's how they met. Ooh, a picture. Mr. Torres. Thick as thieves, those two. Ever since Lorraine died, they only had each other. Marie was suffering when he was in intensive care. That was a nasty knife wound. So that was the burglary that we learned about earlier. I'm just going through everything. She stop about time travel and black holes and stuff. I just wanted to do something simple. Calculate shit. Boring is what she said. Her. The weird kid talked boring. So yeah, we settled on antimatter because who wants to be boring? Sure. Uh, numbers and shit, that's what I do. I'm an accountant by day. If, if you've never seen any of my other videos, I've mentioned that before. All right, so we got a whiteboard here. Chemistry holds no surprises. Love that. Okay. Ooh, Rubik's Cube. Hated that thing. <laughs> that was a quick one. That was a really quick one. All right, so I think we've seen everything here. Oh, sheet of paper. That's Marie's birthday. That's weird. I guess she wrote it down for that Ben guy for her pizza and movie party. I'm right, assuming... I have been a little jealous. <laughs> okay, I was just going to say, I'm assuming Kelsey was not invited and was a little jealous, but she admitted it. That's fine. Let's go back to the journal and see if we filled in enough. Maybe we've... Un oh, phone. A phone. Okay. Let's see. That's Trevor's phone number. He called her. I knew he blamed her for everything. Though she should have blamed him for what he did to her and Mr. Torres. So Trevor wasn't the one that, that stabbed Mr. Torres, right? I don't think he was. If he was, that's really messed up. Oh, so now we have a nine. Okay, let's go to the front of the journal. Let's go all the way to the front. All right. Let's look at all of our numbers so far. So we have a four. We have a nine. Do we have anything else? We have a five. Oh, we're getting close, but we're not there yet. Oh, damn it. So we have three of the five. So let's continue to search around here a little bit. 
Uh, what have we not uncovered yet? Man, I feel like we've looked everywhere. Let's see. There's got to be something here. Oh, I think I thought. Oh, sunglasses. Okay, good. I wore those a lot. Not to protect my eyes, but to hide them. I didn't want anyone to know. Okay. The fan we've already looked at. So this is a pretty, uh, this is a pretty heart-wrenching story of these two. These two have been through a lot. This game is getting tough. All right. So this is, this is a really, really cool game. Very well made. And it's free on Steam, as I mentioned earlier. Uh, let's search around here a little bit more. Open drawer. We already got that. Smokey. Okay, we haven't seen this one. She hated my cigarettes. Every time I felt like going out and buying a pack, she made me put the money in that money jar. One day, that money would pay for our gas to drive to college. We only needed money for the one way. I ended up using it to get to Vancouver. Let's go back to our journal and see. Maybe we've gotten enough. All right, I'm going all the way to the front. All right, so let's see. Our numbers, our numbers. We have a four. Ah, uh, but this page looks blank. I think, I think I'm still missing stuff. All right, so we have a four. We have a nine. We have a five. No, so still nothing. Still nothing. All right, so I have to search here a little bit more. Kelsey's phone. I think I looked at that, didn't I? No, I, I haven't. I was so lucky. An adoring boyfriend. Free burgers from the kitchen he worked in. Sparkly things he bought me. I thought if I took care of him, he'd take care of me, and we'd get out, just in case I didn't get that scholarship. I had no idea where the money came from. So here is Kelsey. Here is a pic- you're looking at a picture of me right now. Red hair eating a burger. Um, okay. That's not what I was expecting. But we got another journal update, so that's good. That's what I'm looking for. Kelsey's phone... I'm searching for every little nook and cranny here. Oh, oh, a beer bottle back here. A beer bottle. That was hiding. That's not fair. Mr. Ooh, and it's a one. Loved that beer. After the robbery, he only had a couple left. Apparently, they were hard to come by. Still, we decided to try a bottle once. Marie loved that label. She drew it in her journal. I remember that. All that happened later that night, I'm not sure. Maybe I don't want to remember. All right. So we found another one. I think this is going to be a number one. And now we're going to play spin the bottle. It landed on the floor. Okay. Enough with that. Journal updated. Sweet. All right. I think we're one away. I have to find one more clue. All right. So I have to. Oh, ooh, bike basket. Let's Trevor see. was never far off, though. When Marie and I rode our bikes through dark nights just to get a taste of those perfect oranges, I knew he was lurking in the shadows. Oh. I never told her, but I think that's how he found us. He followed us back to the room. Oh, boy. Okay. So this Trevor kid, I don't know exactly what he did to them, other than I know he harassed her, and the principal just completely ignored it. But, man, this Trevor guy, is he's kind of giving me goosebumps, actually. He sounds like a real skeeve ball. I don't even know if that's a word. Skeeve ball. Ooh, name badge. Come on. Food rescue. Yeah, it was a good place to be. Damn it. Until Marie showed up. I know she didn't mean anything by it, but the pity in her eyes. Worse than being hungry. So that's Marie now, I guess. I guess we're looking at a picture of Marie. So she looks a little bit more normal than I do. I'm Kelsey, and I have red hair. Oh, and green eatery. Come on, have a number. Have a number. The green eatery. Ah, damn. Green as in with fungus. Ew. Yes, I am never eating Ayurvedic lasagna ever again. But some people must have liked Mr. Jones's cooking because he was out every night cooking his green stuff. What is Ayurvedic lasagna? I've, I'm a paisan. I'm Italian. I've never even heard of that. So, I don't know. Maybe I'm just being ignorant here. All right, so we found two more things. Let's go back to our... Oh, can I open this little thing? What's that? Nope, I guess I can't. We're going to go back to our journal. I don't think we got a number there, though. No, we still don't. We need that final little section out there. All right, we're going to keep searching. All right, so I have been searching 
far and wide, and I cannot find anything that I've been missing. So, if you guys could, ha if you guys know what the fifth thing is, mention it in the comments below. But I think I'm gonna basically just try to guess it. All right. So if you go all the way to the front. So what do we have here? Oh wait, we have it. When did we get the three? I don't remember getting the three. I've been searching. I literally, I skipped forward so you guys didn't have to watch it. But I was searching every corner of this room for like a half hour. All right, so let's see. We have a three. We have a four. We have a nine. So three, four, nine, five, and one. Three, four, five, nine, one. Did I say that wrong? Let's just check one more time before I go crazy. All right. Three, four, nine, five, one. Nice. Okay. Awesome. I didn't know that. What did I say? I don't even know what I said. I we need got to three, find the key. four, a five, nine, five, one. Yay. All right. There we Good go. Work, Kelsey. Oh, oh. my God. Oh, she bought the gun. She the past, got the gun. Like the future is indefinite and exists only as a spectrum of possibilities. Oh my god. Stephen Hawking said that. I wish it were true. But there was nothing I could do about the past. It was definite as hell. Sometimes I didn't get Marie. I really thought a night by Jones's pool would help her relax. She used to love it there. But she insisted someone had been watching us. I just wanted to have a good time. Probably and she was ruining it. So I said some things I shouldn't have. She just stood there, staring at the window. I was so annoyed. And that's when I knew she'd been right. Trevor. Right there in the room. He'd just come in through the open window. Oh, no. How did he find us? He didn't know where Marie and I lived. I always made sure of that. But he took an orange from his backpack and started peeling it. It had been Trevor by the pool. And he'd followed us home. Oh, God. He said to Marie, I told you not to mess with me. But still, I didn't get it. No, it wasn't until he started moving in on her that I realized it was Marie. He was after... Marie, he blamed her for everything, and he had a knife. I'd never seen him so angry, so evil. Marie tried to get it away from him. He asked her why she never answered her phone. Did she not read her emails? Or did she think they were hollow threats? God, I just wanted to punch him with anything I could lay my hands on. My backpack. I smashed it against his wrist, knocking the knife out of his hands. Marie went for it. But Trevor was faster. He kicked her in the head. Holy I dove for the shit. knife, but he jumped me. As we struggled, he hissed. Didn't I get enough action yet? Maybe I needed another baseball bat to get my kicks. I stopped. Because right then I knew what he was up to. He asked Marie about Mr. Torres. Was he all right? Did he still get stomach aches? Marie lay on the floor by the bed, in shock. Realizing he, it had been Trevor who it was almost Trevor. killed her father. Holy shit. Then Trevor looked at me, added with a smile. And her. That's when it all went to pieces. Trevor ripped us apart, and he was enjoying it. Marie didn't understand. I tried to explain, apologized, but she wasn't listening. She kept asking me if I'd been there with Trevor in their house. Trevor stirred things up even more. He told her it was me who had hit her over the head with a baseball bat, that I'd enjoyed it. I screamed in frustration, no, that's not what happened. Tears streamed down Marie's face. She couldn't believe I would do that. Hurt her deliberately. God, I wanted Trevor to stop talking. I attacked him, scratched his face, hit him wherever I could. I hated him. He was twisting everything. I wanted to tell her that I was sorry. Yes, we robbed the house. Oh. And we got caught by Mr. Torres. But I never meant for anyone to get hurt. I didn't smash Marie's head. I panicked. I wanted to stop her from seeing me. When I realized how badly injured she was, I called the police. I tried to stay. But 
Trevor wouldn't let me. He pulled me by my hair into the van. But Marie wasn't listening. I was losing it, and I like to think I beat Trevor up pretty good. But Trevor punched back harder and faster. He was about to crack my skull. Marie clawed for the box beside her, opened it. She screamed, told us to stop, pointed that nine millimeter at us. Trevor went nuts, charged for her. She screamed, told him to stay back. She'd never shot a gun in her life. She wasn't going to start now. Trevor grabbed her by the shoulders and... Oh my God! What do you think? That just scared the crap out of me. It's not necessarily what really happened or how others remember it. But Trevor fell back on the carpet, dead. That we all remember. Oh my God! I think I want to cry. Is that the end of the game? Oh my God! Mom, where are you? Did you get the journal? I'll be down in a minute. Anna Marie is getting a little worked up here. She threatened to smoke a cigar in your car. Don't let her. Don't let her smoke. I love that car. She knows you do. Get down here, Mom. You're taking like forever. I'll what? Be down in a minute. Bring the journal. Press J to read journal. So now we have the whole journal completed. Wait, I'm so confused. Is Aunt Maria Marie? It's Marie's room? What? So we can leave now? Oh man, that was an emotional roller coaster. Marie's room is the name of the game. I give it a double thumbs up. Who, the developers of this game did an awesome job. If I didn't mention it earlier, it is free on Steam. Um, Marie's Room is the name of the game. Download it today. That was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit me up with a like. Throw me a subscribe. All of that always helps. And more importantly, if you guys have any other game ideas, hopefully it's not as much of an emotional roller coaster as this was. I still think I have to cry. Um, but if you guys have any game ideas, suggest them in the comments below, and I can basically guarantee you, if you suggest a game, I will play it. Have a good one, everybody, and I will see you all in the next video.